Hey dads, for some of you who have children who are, who've got different type of diseases, physical disabilities, some even, some even say handicaps, it's not that you as a father have created a broken or damaged child. A lot of men, we think that if our life or our children or our situations are perfect, that we're failures and that we're at fault. All things work together for those who love God and who are called according to his purposes. So, this is that season, it's that child was created in the perfect image of God, and there's nothing wrong with it. They're exactly the way they're supposed to be. And the sooner as fathers that we realize that, the better we're going to be, and the better that child's quality of life is going to be. So if your child has issue that requires medicine or uh, acute round-the-clock care, things like that, the main thing is we've got to get over it, get over our mental sadness or depression about it, and let's move on. That child needs us, first and foremostly, to be by their side, to be supporting them, and working out the plan of attack to increase their quality of life and improve their quality of life. I've got several children that have issues with asthma. As a parent, I've got to make sure, or as a single parent specifically, I've got to make sure that their asthma plan is intact and is, is sure, and I'm assured of what needs to happen when those kids are with me and away from me. So if, if it, even if it comes down to writing their names on their asthma medications if they're different so we don't make mistakes when it comes time to administer them or if the children are going to go somewhere and hang hang out with family and friends that those that are caring for them at that time have a very clear picture as to what needs to be taken when there's no shame in writing things down there's no shame in th putting things in your smartphones as a contact that's what i do and i use even our children's hospital has an app i use their app that helps me keep all of their medications, their dosing styles, even the times that they've got to get administered in, the, in that application and other electronic areas. So it's always ready for me so I don't have to think about it should something happen. Keep your plan, fathers, keep your plan, make it plain. Even when you're going out on vacation, going out in the car, sometimes you've got to keep medication with you in the car. If they've got to have it at school, let's get on, make sure you get all the medications ready, fill out all the proper forms so your child has a great quality of life. So let's get out of the depressed mode, let's get out of the denial mode, and let's work it out. Let's make it work. Come on, dads. Great tip for the day. Have a blessed day.